and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be giving you topics and a, basically a guide to breeding in Wild Horse Islands. So this is the breeding center and here it is on the mainland map. So when you go and start breeding you're going to need some money now, I don't have that much money as I probably won't be breeding because most of my horses are maxed out or they're on a cool down. But if I can, I will. So when you come to the breeding center, you're going to want to talk to Francine. She's sitting here right on the counter. So when you walk in, she should be right here. You will talk to her and you either say you want to foal, that's how you breed, or you want to see her shop. Now, if you want a foal, which you want to breed, this is what you will do. We have the girls and the boys. Now, for the girls, these are the girls I have available. So, for example, let's get Hey Hey, my Devil Palomino Kleinsdale. And now for the male, I have Malika the Arabian, Pebble the Frisian, and Katie the Ford. Let's go with Malika. Now for this, this will cost 3,311 tokens, and I have 3,576. So here are the chances and what breed you would get, and the coat color. So for 23.90, you have a 23.92% chance for a Bay Sabina. So that is Malika. And that means this percentage, if I were to get it, I would get this horse. If I eat, percent Dabble Palomino, Clydesdale Arabian, so I would get this horse. And now I have a 14.35% chance of getting a base Sabino Clydesdale. Let's move this down. I have 12.78 chance to get a random Clydesdale and or, or Arabian coat. And I have a 12.65% chance to get a Dabble Palomino Arabian and a 2.44% chance of getting a unique breeding coat. If you were to breed something like these two, you're most likely to get a bay and gray chimera. Now, I'm going to try and just, just show you for the sake of the video, the percentages. So my highest one is I could get another bay Sabina or Arabian. So let's try but I hope I get the Clydesdale Arabian unique breeding coat. So I got a Clydesdale, another um, Dapple Palomino Clydesdale, and it had a 1% chance. If you want to age your fill, full, my bad, you go to her shop, Francine's shop, and you would buy this, the growth potion. Feed this to your full to make them turn into an adult instantly. Consumed on, used, and reversible with a forever full potion. Now, if you give the full the potion, they would just grow up to be the adult. So let's say I gave our little horsey, our little full, the potion. Then it would just, boom, transform into the big version. More about this, if you have a horse and they're blacked out, like let's say I want to train Hogney. And it says this animal cannot be bred. That means it's either an event, an event horse. It's already been bred, and you have to wait for the cooldown to finish. It's a legacy breed, so it can't be bred again. Or you don't have a strong enough bond. Now for this, Malika. See, I have to breed again a day, 17 hours. Now if I were to get a horse like this, it can't be bred since it's a legacy. Now, if I were to get tomato, I would have zero out of 25 bond. So I would need to bond with my horse. Now, the fastest way to bond with your horse, in my opinion, let's go ahead and get tomato out. The fastest way is to just feed it food. And once you figure out tomato likes corn, so you would figure out their favorite food by giving them food, and that should boost it up pretty quickly. We're already at 10. Now it's going up by 3. 
and you have to, the max is, the minimum is 25. You just keep feeding your horse. Now your horse should be at 25, which you can now breed. I hope you guys like this video, and thanks for watching.